Oh my god, here we go, intro music, and here we go, yeah, being 8-bit homo, woo, yeah, Monster Cat, please approve my license, boom, 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 intro music, yeah. After the mess that was today, I was actually excited to get to bed and think of new ideas to get back at Margaret and Becky. Okay, new day, new me. I think I have a plan in mind that might actually work. So when I arrived at school, obviously looking amazing as always, I decided it'd be a good idea to try and get some dirt on Margaret and Becky to ruin their social status. So I decided to ask around to see if I could get any juicy gossip on those two twats. What do you know about Margaret and Becky? Oh, they are both hella hot. I would definitely bang both of them. Margaret once won a contest to be a hand model in a porn for charity. She's so thoughtful. I heard that Becky once made a video that went viral online of her singing Nicki Minaj's Anaconda while riding a unicycle drunk. That girl's got talent. Word on the street is that Margaret can run a mile in under five minutes while wearing hooker heels. Crazy, right? Oh, those silly girls are riot. I wish they would give me some fashion tips. Or, or I, I mean, give my wife some fashion tips. <laughs> I, don't, I don't wear women's clothing, who said that? I'm pretty sure that both of them fought in a deadly competition that resulted in them nearly having to commit suicide, but they like, totally survived and went on to become famous. Or, or was that in the Hunger Games? Ugh, none of these stupid bitches can tell me anything about Margaret or Becky. Maybe I'll just have to do a little bit of investigation of my own. Jesus Christ, it smells like a tuna sauna in here. What the fuck are these girls eating at lunch? I figured a good way to get to know these girls would be to see them in their natural habitat, the bathroom. Oh my god, Becky, how are we so freaking popular? Because we some boss ass bitches with some great A vaginas, this pussy is pure. You don't have to repeat that twice. Okay, let's get this over with. I was so confused what exactly they were intending to get over with. God, look at my sides, they're so fat. I look like a KFC addicted reject Oompa Loompa. Yeah, your sides look fucking gross, but not as gross as my obnoxiously large nipples. They literally look like semi-trucks headlights beaming down on people. What the fuck? Ugh, and my ass is so hairy it makes zero sense. Like, how does a woman end up looking like Bigfoot is camping out in her backyard? Girl, I feel you. When I look at my vagina, it looks like my bikini waxer decided to have an off day with a lawnmower. I'm pretty sure she waxed her initial somewhere up in there. Like, I understood that they were trying to lower their self-esteem in the bathrooms because that's just what they do, which is weird. But the smell in this bathroom is so bad, it started irritating my nose, and... Oh, and my teeth? They're so... <laughs> oh, shit. Excuse me, who is in here? Well, I found myself in a pickle of a situation and I had to get out the only way I knew how. Uh, this is the janitor. I was cleaning out one of the stalls. Ew, you mean to tell me you heard everything we just said? Uh, no, totally didn't. I'll have you know, Mr. Janitor, that the reason we even say any of this stuff is because we are literally flawless. And it's the only way to keep ourselves so humble. Yeah, if no one can speak bad about us, we'll just have to do it to ourselves. Are you fucking kidding me? Ugh, gross. He's probably in there masturbating or something. Ugh, let's leave. Yeah, bye pig. Try not to lose the magnifying glass you have to use to see your penis while you're busy in there. Yikes, I just dodged a bullet. I was nearly caught by both of those skanks and I still don't have anything to show for it. Who would have known this whole investigation thing would be so hard? I had no choice but to continue to ask around for more information until... Are you sure you don't know? All you ladies pop your pussy like this. Oh, sorry, that's my phone. Let me get that. Uh, hello? Hello, Jenny. Nice to finally talk with you. Excuse me, who is this? My name is Infochan, and I'm here to help. Wait, your name is Infochan? What the fuck? Were your parents drunk when they named you? You're kidding, right? It obviously isn't my real name, duh. Yeah, but if you get to choose your nickname, why would you choose that? Well, because I like it. Yeah, but I'm just saying, like if- Oh my god, bitch, do you want me to help or not? Ugh, help with what? We have similar interests. I want to see Margaret and Becky pay as well, and I think I have the perfect plan to do just that. Hmm, I don't know. You sound like a robot, and I don't trust robots. Believe me, I can't- wait. You think I'm a robot? Are you stupid? What? Robots are scary. They can, like, build themselves and easily take over the planet. You can't trust them. Oh, are you serious? I'm obviously not actually a robot. I'm doing this to mask my identity, you know what? No, I'm not gonna explain myself. Do you want my damn help or not? Uh, fine. Whatever you say, robot. Good. 
Meet me by the vending machines and we'll discuss this more in private. Uh, thanks for watching the episode today. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like down below, share with your friends, and uh, maybe hit that subscribe button. I'll be in here doing janitor things and totally not touching myself or anything. Well, uh, leave the lights on when you leave. <laughs> and, uh, bye! Outro music! Ba -ba -da 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 -da. Outro music that sounds somewhat similar to the intro! Ba -da 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 -da. Yeah!